Hey guys, what's up? Uh, so I know you all saw me with this frame a little bit on my update video. Somebody called me up. It's Mardi Gras season. Everybody wants a special bike, so I pulled it out of the yard. I put a seat post on it. Uh, so you can see the little seat post there. And I'm doing through the Brondo process, which is, uh, I'm not a, you know, I don't put it on beautifully to begin with. But I like to sand it down pretty, though. It's going to be something more fused and round and pretty like that than it is like that. So anyways, uh, I'm going to show you all little videos as, as I sand and bondo this bike and prime and shit and put together to finish. And uh, just so I can, uh, mainly this is more of an evidence that I built this. Yeah, that's it. So, stay tuned. All right. I know y'all, uh, so I just got the Bondo started yesterday. Um, most of the Bondo work's done, for the most part. I'm still seeing little, just little spots here and there, and this is what I'm doing. I'm just, see the spot, and I'm just rubbing a little Bondo over the little rough spots. So to make it smoother, like that, so I can fill in all the little pits, but you can see it's a lot prettier than it was. See, I got a little touch up there, but it came out pretty smooth, not too shabby. I'm not an expert at the Bondo thing yet. I'm still learning, I'm still learning about what makes it look good, what makes it don't look good. So, uh, Hate to say it, but the bike's not going to change much in color because I'm just painting it flat black. Gentlemen, um, exactly can't afford one of my paint jobs right now. <laughs> I like to hear that. I can't afford your paint job. That means only the rich people and the best get my work. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Anyways, so there's that, almost done. And then uh, I'll take some more shots as I. Uh, Get it done painted and assembled. We got the Bondo work done, and we're going to finish the assembly outside just because it's such a beautiful day. Uh, see this little crank in there? I love how it looks like it's just floating. So, I'm going to give you a couple more shots and short clips as I get it together. Back tire and chain, rear fender, and now it's done. I got some dust to wipe off. I got to stop in over at Gherkins, get a basket, do that open frame. Got to love it, man. There's no other frame like that rolling around in New Orleans. This ain't your grandma's puppy. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, so I'm going to go run the gherkins real quick and buy a basket. Uh, like I said, for three bill, I don't care if I have to go get a basket for this thing. But this ain't the last of the video. i got to go take this thing on location with a badass backdrop, get some shots of it, so you'll be seeing a little bit of us over there, too. I ain't gonna lie, I want to throw up a little bit in my mouth, just a little bit. It's disgusting. It's smooth. It's classy. Alright, well I guess I'm officially finished with it. I wiped it off clean. Got the shine back on the wheels again. I went, uh, went to Gherkins, got this basket for the gentleman. I'd have to say, it rides pretty good. It's got a good balance to it. A little lighter than it used to be. With the excessive amount of stuff going on. Let's see if we can just I'm gonna do a little walk around. Uh, those welds in the front headset, that's mine, that's my doing, that's not the factory, as you can tell, the forks have been raked out a bit, the frame's completely left open now, no seat post tubing, I fattened the rear of the bike and shortened the rear of the bike, give more of a uh, bobber look to it, a cafe board track kind of frame style, even though the rest of the bike's not dressed up like it should be. Um, I was going to put a professional car paint 
show job on this, uh, car show job on it, and he just wanted to get a flat black, you know, because they're going to do pirates for Mardi Gras, and around here, people are more concerned about their Mardi Gras costumes than they are anything else. But yeah, man, uh, looking pretty good. Let's see if maybe I can take it for a quick spin. It was when it came out the first time, too. Now I've got a new factory. It was really nice. Rex was a Texan out of New Orleans. Say it again. Rex was a Texan out of New Orleans. <laughs> Where's the button on top? Hold it. <laughs> 